In this free tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can hide sold out variants in Shopify Dawn theme in the year 2022. It will work for previous versions of Dawn and probably future versions as well. And this one is 100% guaranteed to work. Uh, just to explain the problem quickly. So here we have four sizes, but two of them are sold out. So you actually have to click each one and wait to see that the S and the M are sold out. That is a terrible user experience. Unfortunately, Shopify doesn't have a solution for this, so we have to take the matters into our own hands. And I will show you how. Three easy copy pastes and we will be done. Uh, just to explain a little bit, this problem has been going on at least since 2016. I have gone through pretty much all the tutorials and the videos and the code snippets and the blog posts and the community questions and answers. But to be honest, uh, I really haven't found anything that works, at least for the Dawn theme, uh, except maybe some paid apps. So that's why I wanted to create this tutorial. This is guaranteed to work. Okay, so let's jump right to it. Um, so in our Shopify admin, we are going to take our theme. I'm going to use the fresh Dawn. This is the older version, but we'll go with that. Click edit code. And now here you will be searching for main dash product dot liquid. So this one main product liquid. Open that one up. And from my blog post, there will be uh, three code snippets. First one is the variant radio. So let's start with variant radios. I will copy this code and I will be searching for variant radios. I'm just, just going to start with variant with this little thing to start. So I will find the variant radios like this. So. I'm going to select the variant radio start to finish, as you can see, ending in variant radios and starting with variant radios. And I'm going to get rid of this code here. And I'm going to, I have already copied that and I'm just going to paste the better variant radios in. Okay, next is the variant select. So let's copy this code the better version of variant selects with the variant hiding capabilities. And here after variant radios, which we just fixed, there's going to be variant select. So start here, variant selects, and where does it end here? Up until variant selects where it ends. And again, get rid of the pr normal variant selects and copy paste the better variant selects. Next up, we have this little checkbox thing. So this is in the JSON part. Um, so look for this part here. And let's see. Hmm. Copy this code. And I'm going to add it here after this stuff. Uh, oops. All right, let's click save. And then in our uh, customizer, I'm going to refresh. Then I'm going to be clicking on the variant picker. And here our code has add, added this hide un unavailable variants checkbox. So you can still see the S and M which are sold out. They're still visible. So we will click here. And there you have it. The um, unavailable sold out variants are now hidden. Okay, now one thing to note is that this simple free tutorial 
only works for one level of variance, meaning that if you have size or color, it's gonna work perfectly. If you have size and color, or maybe you have three levels like size, color, and material, then it will get a lot more complicated. And this uh, simple free tutorial will no longer work. For those cases, I recommend a more advanced option. I have made a Shopify variant hider. I have spent literally weeks on this, collaborating with a super talented uh, coder. And I have made at least like 12 uh, new versions of it from customer feedback. So uh, it's really good one. It works for all the new free Shopify themes, Dawn, Color, Block, Sense, etc. And if it doesn't work for you, I will give you a refund or fix it. But yes, we have now successfully hidden these. So this will work for simple stores. If you need more advanced stuff, check out my plugin. And thank you for watching. Good luck with your e-commerce store.